Hey, what's up? I'm Chris Hillier from Teva. We're at 2013 Sea Otter and it's hot as hell. Alright, we're introducing a new clipless pedal shoe uh, called the Teva Pivot. We saw a big gap between what was out there for cross country shoes versus what was out there for, for downhill shoes and we wanted something right in the middle because most of us all ride trails and we gotta, you know, we gotta ride uphill. We don't live close to chairlifts. So we started off, we wanted something that was gonna be super light, uh, super stiff, but also something that we could walk in. It was comfortable. We didn't want it to look goofy and uh, we wanted to innovate a little bit. So we'll start off a little bit talking about what's cool about the bottom of this thing. Uh, we knew we wanted to start off with rubber. We had to have a rubber outsole. It gives us great grip. So we wanted to actually put some pretty grooves in it so we get some traction going uphill and downhill. It's a little bit of a Teva tradition to have that good traction in the heel and the toe. Um, we also wanted to really reduce the amount of rubber just to keep this thing as light as possible. We all, we're all sensitive to that. As far as the shank, none of us pedal bikes with our toes and our heels, so we really wanted to make sure that it was nice and stiff in the middle, but allowed for good flexibility in the toe and the heel, and everything about this thing is all about comfort and cushioning outside of that, so you get amazing power transfer right through the, right down to the pedal, but when you're off the bike, you get nice cushy foam, also the foam keeps it nice and light. Beyond that, there's a lot of these shoes out there that don't work with all the pedals, what's up with that? So so we wanted to make sure that our shoe, out of the box, you could bolt any cleat onto it and you could step into every single pedal on the market and just have a great experience. Even, you know, these things, when you snap them in, they make a nice audible click. It's the way it's supposed to sound. So every single pedal system from Crank Brothers to Look to Time and Shimano as well, all works nicely right out of the box. No shims, no crazy stuff. Next innovation we work to, these components that people put inside these shoes are terrible. We saw so many bad examples of these threads ripping out and just bad quality, rusty in internal components. So we started from scratch using stainless steel components. Uh, we developed our own hardware using Torx head bolts and we're compatible with all these different platforms. But with Shimano and Crank Brothers, we actually had the opportunity to mount the cleats from the top. And there's a couple of cool things about that. One of them, as you walk around, you're not going to be stepping on your hardware. So you don't have to sit there with a little tiny screwdriver and get all the dirt and mud and little tiny rocks out of the out of the bolts. Uh, you just step on the on this nice stainless steel nut and it stays protected. And inside the shoe, your bolts are protected so they're good as new. Uh, another nice thing about that, you can actually mount your cleats onto your shoe, step it into the pedal, and we've developed a little tiny port right here in the top of the shoe. You can drop the wrench inside. You can actually adjust the cleat while it's on the bike. Tighten it down, put that sock liner back in, and you're good to go with the cleat all adjusted. We also, we hate water coming up in through those grooves in the bottom of the shoe. So we put a little rubber gasket underneath this, this uh, plate. So all that water and debris it just stays on the outside. So you never get that stuff soaking up through the bottom. Now, a couple pedal systems don't allow for that. So with look and time, you can still mount the look and the time or the Crank Brothers and Shimano right from the bottom if that's the way you'd like to mount them. And we've got nice rolled screw uh, threads here right in that very same insert. So you can mount it the traditional way. And these are really nice quality threads. They're rolled, they're not cut. So uh, you have a really good longevity and good quality for that. And with the upper, we have lots of breathability so our people uh, in the in the warmer regions don't get their feet overheated but also in the northern climates if you get your feet wet all the foam that's used in the shoe is all closed cell foam so it doesn't absorb water and we all know what it's like when your sneakers get wet and they just they're like a big sponge so these are fantastic they'll dry a lot quicker um, and stay lighter all right i'm chris and that's the new pivot from teva